Samsung fanboys, Apple fanboys. We've seen them get hyped and get into arguments about whether Apple is better or Samsung is better. But here's why I think the argument of Apple vs Samsung is probably one of the stupidest arguments ever. So I have two main points to speak about. Firstly, no company is perfect. I'm sick of fanboys constantly looking towards the company or companies that they love and thinking they can do no wrong. No matter what the company releases, they want to get a part of it. They want the device. The company could release a device that crashes every second and they will defend the company and try to make an excuse for them. Or even when a company releases a new device which barely has any differences from the previous model, they still go out and get it and claim that it's new, innovative and groundbreaking. It's almost like the same thing with Logan Paul and his fans. They blindly follow him no matter what he does and try to defend him even if he's obviously in the wrong. So stop blindly following your favorite tech company and falling for everything that they do. Now I'm not saying it's a bad thing to have preferences, but there's a clear line between loving what a company does and blindly following that company like it's a god and not seeing through if they do something that does not make sense. Secondly, it's okay to hate the product, but when you get to the point that you constantly keep ranting about anything that a company makes, then you're blindly hating the company. These kind of people dislike everything that the opposing company which they hate does. The company could literally release a device that is 10 times better than what the company which they are loyal to has released and they still will say that it's garbage. And okay, I get it that you don't like it but when it gets to the point that all they talk about is what they hate about the other company and when you ask them why do they love the company that they have sided with, they answer you that it's because their company is better. Then things get a little bit pointless I guess. They blindly hate the company which opposes their favorite and blindly follow the company which they side with just because it's quote unquote better. There's no real reasoning behind that at all. Finally, brands are not your friends. No matter how much you love their products, at the end of the day they do not truly care about you. For most big companies, the true goal is not to satisfy the consumer but to make what sells best. That's the harsh reality. The company does not even care if you exist. The end goal is profit. Now, I'm not saying that certain companies do not care about the consumers because a good bit of companies do indeed try to interact with their fan base. But what you need to keep in mind is that brands are not your friends, no matter how much you love them, that's true. Just because you love a brand, that does not mean that you have to defend and trust what the brand does no matter what. Just because you love Apple doesn't mean you instantly have access to Apple board meetings and the same can be said with Samsung or any other tech company or company in the world for that matter. I guess this is mostly just a sort of chilled out rant format video but I just wanted to make this video and get this out there. Um, thanks for watching till the end, if you enjoyed the video any bit and you're new, feel free to leave a like, subscribe for more and comment your thoughts below. That's about it for today and I will be seeing you in the next video.